Apple Computer was also looking at the growing home market. They gave sneak previews of their new technology called Pippin. This is almost a throwback to the Commodore 64 days. The Pippin box connects to your TV set, allowing you to play CD-ROM games and access the internet without having to buy a full-fledged computer and monitor. You obviously don't have as much flexibility, but you still get a lot of the feature sets. So Pippin is an interesting example of a device that would let you for 500 bucks, 600 bucks, run all of the Mac software on a television and that kind of a hybrid device has potential. In fact, it's one that we think could actually propel Apple into a whole new level of computer users or home uh, who won't afford the $1,000, $2,000 computer. Pippin is a key part of the new Apple strategy to get a larger share of the PC marketplace. And to do that, they are teaming up with partners who understand consumer electronics. Because I, uh, the important thing is, is to reach the entire installed base of color TV people. So it is way bigger than us and our customer base. And for that, we need new industry partnerships to reach out. So we cannot, we shouldn't compete with our own partners. And as the first licensees such as Banda and Mitsubishi, they help us reach a whole new range of people. Future licensees will help us reach whole new other ranges of people. So it will be a much faster access to customers, much broader access, and much lower cost access than from a